Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to fix a very common problem that happens with many games. When you try to launch a game by clicking on the desktop icon or the launcher file, you might see this error message, Steam failed to initialize. Please verify that the Steam client is running and try again. This error is not only in GTA 5, but it can also show up in many other games that normally connect to Steam. Now most people think something is broken, maybe their Steam is corrupted or they need to reinstall the game. But actually the reason is very simple. The launcher is always looking for Steam, and if it doesn't find it, the game refuses to start. That's why clicking on the normal launcher or X file will not work. So how do we fix it? Inside the game's installation folder, there is usually a special file that lets you launch the game directly. In many cases, it will be a bat file. For example, in my GTA folder it is named Play Bat. When I click this file, the game opens without any error. So the solution is, instead of clicking the usual game icon, you need to find this bat file or the alternative startup file that is included in your folder. That is the file that will bypass the Steam check and launch your game properly. To save time, you can also create a shortcut of that file and move it to your desktop. So from now on, you can just double click and play without seeing the error. This works not only for GTA 5, but also for many other games that give the same Steam failed to initialize error. And that's it guys, a very simple fix. If this video helped you, make sure to like it and subscribe for more easy tips and solutions.